Beijing Royal Fighters offered me a leadership role two years ago, making me a rookie coach for the Beijing Royal Fighters. Today, I have a new dream. That dream includes helping to bring another CBA championship to the city of Beijing. Now, that would be awesome. I was so excited when I landed my first head coaching job. However, what I quickly realized is landing a job and being successful could be distinctly different. Like all rookie coaches, I have faced my share of challenges. The only way to win is to fight, and the front office knows I will fight to the end to give our team the best chance at winning. This is no easy task because I am in the midst of transforming and growing as a head coach. As an old and traditional Chinese saying goes, after surviving in innumerable trials and hardships, the bond between a people is bound to become stronger. To win in the CBA, you must put in hard work and be willing to learn. If you ask me how to win a CBA championship, I will tell you the first thing you must do is not focus on yourself. Focus on what matters most, and that is building a strong relationship with your teammates. You also need to see your teammates as your family, and they need to see you in the same way. It is equally vital that you learn and know when to be a guiding force to help your teammates grow and help build them in their confidence. What is just as important is learning to accept constructive criticism. Why does the spirit of sports persist and stand tall in this world? For the spirit can always contain the most important energy that motivates us through hardship and struggle. A team that faces adversaries together can only become victorious when its members are inclusive, collaborate, and learn to think and become one. Being on and becoming a winning team